Today we will see how we can install an operating system on a VMware ESXi directly, not using the vCenter or anything, but I already have access to my VMware ESXi. It's a smaller machine. I want to select the create register VM. If I have an OVA, OVA file or OVA file, I'll be using this one, but I'm going to, or if you already have a VM that you want to mount it, you can use this particular option. I'm going to create a new Windows 2019 machine. So I'll go here and I'm going to give a name. I'm going to install CyberArk uh, Vault. Since I'm going to install 2019, the available ESXi 6.5 in my environment, I have only 2016, but it does support 2019 Windows Server. I have six terabyte on my machine. I want to give uh, three CPUs, four gig RAM, 40 gig hard drive. And I want to select the operating system. I'll go to the CD. I have a ISO file under the ISO. I'll select 2019 and uh, I'll go and finish it. So here is the machine. We seen that one. I'll double click on it. Give me the console of the machine. So it's pretty much I am looking at the uh, monitor of that particular physical machine kind of environment. I'm getting it. Windows 2019. I'm going to select the default. I'm going to install it. I'm not going to inst install the standard. This is the without the GUI interface. This is with the GUI interface. Uh, I want it with the 2000 data center. I will go so I can have a GUI environment. Accept the licenses, of course. Machine automatically will restart. Okay, here is my operating system's password. I'm going to give a password for the administrator who will have all the accesses. Oops. Okay, finalizing the settings, restarted. I can access the system, but now, so I'm going to go here, go to the console and run the remote console. When we are starting, I can click on this. I will access, this is I'm using the um, VMware ESXi's direct um, console access. I'm putting the password I applied. Now I want to access through the RDP. So I have to make it sure. If I go to the local server, I do two things always. Uh, just to as it is a lab environment at my home this is i will stop it because otherwise just i'm starting to set up it will create a problem for me then i will go to the remote desktop i will enable it since this computer is going to be used for a specific purpose uh, if it is a server, I will be going and applying the network IP address. So options, right mouse key. Instead of DHCP, I will be applying in a specific IP address.
Now, if I want to access the same server, use 30, that's the IP address we gave. And yeah, administrator. This is a password I'm using it. Are you sure this is the computer you're going to access it? Voila, I am already in the system. It'll be logged off because I use the same username to log in. That's all. Uh, and how we can install the Windows 2019 operating system directly ESXi 6.5 interface. Thank you.